The tributes have already begun to pour in for the late Dr. Leroy Clark. Born in Belmont, Port of Spain on November 7, 1938, Leroy Clark leaves the world today as a visual artist who wished us to see and to go deeper than surfaces allowed. Sunil Lala takes a look at some of the tributes following his passing, one of which came from the university where he received an honorary doctorate some 13 years ago. Minister of Tourism, Culture and the Arts Randall Mitchell remembers Dr. Leroy Clark as an excellent artist whose work is unmatched. Mr. Mitchell says the chief, as he was fondly known, is considered one of this country's finest contemporary artists and believes Trinidad and Tobago owes a debt to him for his life's contribution. The minister notes that this country is culturally richer because of his work and influence. He recalls that Dr. Clark was conferred the title Master Artist by the National Museum and Art Gallery and received an honorary doctorate of fine arts from UTT in 2008. That university has also issued a statement on Dr. Clark's passing, saying he leaves behind a legacy with authenticity and depth unimaginable. It adds that his prolific body of work transcended his humble upbringing and brought him success and accolades both locally and abroad. UTT says Dr. Clark's work illustrated deep-rooted symbolism from various aspects of his Caribbean heritage, cementing his belief that we should collectively support our own if we are intent on establishing our true identity. A simple tribute to Dr. Clark also came from David Rudder via his Facebook page, stating farewell Leroy Clark. The board management and staff of Queen's Hall also offered condolences to the family of the renowned contemporary artist, saying he was a self-taught artist whose skill grew from a desire to see and to go deeper than surfaces allowed. And opposition leader Kamala Pasad Bissessa also remembered the icon, saying he transformed Caribbean culture and proved that Caribbean artists could stand shoulder to shoulder with those from anywhere around the world. Sonolala, TTT News.